LDL cholesterol, like I said, is to use to make hormones. You need it. So when is LDL bad? LDL is only bad when you eat a lot of carbohydrates and it causes the LDL particles to become small, dense particles. Otherwise, they're light, fluffy particles. The light, fluffy particles go through your bloodstream very easily. It's the small, dense ones that can actually lodge into the arterial walls and cause a plaque. So when your doctor's telling you to lower your cholesterol, you first need to know what kind of cholesterol are we dealing with here? HDL or LDL? And secondly, is that LDL bad? I'm a cardiologist and a lipid specialist. Basically, cholesterol is kind of my thing. There's something to be said about particle size, and that is true. There are different particle sizes. There are different types of LDL particles and cholesterol particles that are more atherogenic, which means stickier and creating plaque, versus particles that are not atherogenic. There's a very simple test. It's a blood test. It's called ApoB, and that actually assesses how many bad particles you have in your blood. But what we know is that it's not all just about particle size. So people who have familial hyperlipidemia and genetic high cholesterols, even if they have high fluffy cotton ball particles, sometimes also will develop atherosclerotic disease and complications from their high cholesterol.